Hey guys, this is Grubbin' the Rangers here, and this isn't really a review, this is just like a pre -vac or something. This was my first airsoft helmet, or helmet I've ever used in airsoft, and you can tell it's kind of beat up. It was originally black, then I spray painted it OD, and then spray painted it tan, because I went from a black, because when I first started my first loadout was black, my second loadout was... OD, and then now I had AC, I still have AC used, I had an AC, I had a tan. So right there I have the Gears of War sign. It's a Matrix, I don't know what type of Matrix, because I got it three years ago. And uh, it's based off of a SWAT helmet compared to the uh, Mitch 2000. And it's a lot lighter. Uh, I did have some... Velcro. This Velcro was adhesive. This Velcro was adhesive. And then this Velcro came with the flag. So I just hot glued it on there. I know it kind of looks bad, but it's pretty cool. I'm planning on giving this to one of my friends who joined my team. You've seen him in my other videos. Henry. Uh. Yeah. So. It's not. It's, it's pretty comfortable. It gets ventilation, but it's not as good as the Mitch. I've got to admit that. So, this isn't... I know it protects your head. That's what I know. In, in Airsoft, if you wear a helmet, if you guys have wear a helmet, most times you know helmets aren't just for looks and BB head protection. It's also for when you fall, which I've seen people do that a lot, and they're like, darn it, I should have had a helmet. Well, I usually don't fall, but I have that helmet over there. So, my friend wanted a helmet, so I'm going to give him this one. And I just want to do a review before I gave it to him. So, Velcro right there. Velcro with the flag, and that is an ACU flag, I believe that's reverse, and a white for a name tag, and then that, so, come rate and subscribe, and I hope you enjoyed.